Mamas and papas, players and haters. Uh, mother, <laughs> sorry, I don't know where that stupid intro came from, but Matthew with Medicaid Vision Tricks here, bringing you a little video Medicaid update, and that's what I think I'm going to start calling these short little smoke videos, is Medicaid updates. So, <laughs> I can't tell, I found a, a new change of location for uh, my during the weekday activities a nice little spot tucked away here's what we're working on today with some fucking lovely Durban poison and uh yeah we're gonna get a little bit and we're gonna get a little medicating in and yeah, it'll be a good good thing all around so don't really have any Ooh, as soon as I open that it reeked though I was going to say, I don't really have any choice nugs to show off, and this camera sucks for doing shit outside anyway, but, just load up a little small bowl, I'm about to walk my happy ass to Circle K, get something to drink, but, before I made that journey, it's a pretty good walk, it's about a, a mile, a mile and a half, maybe, maybe about a mile, mile and a quarter, <clears throat> but, yeah, it's a good little, little hike, so I thought I'd Get a little fucking buzz on going. Oh, I found my green pick, which is a happy day for me, and my homemade lighter leash. So if y'all haven't seen my homemade lighter leashes yet, it's the uh, the band. Actually, the band. This band exactly. This band off the Smock TFV4. Uh, cut into a strip. I made like five of them. Gave them to some friends. Put them on these retractable things. Boom! Instant lighter leash. Works like a fucking charm. So. That's what we got going on right now. So I really like this little spot I found. But anyway. Yesterday's video blog, Medicaid update, whatever, at lunchtime, kind of touched on the fact that I'm in barber school, and we're just not getting that many haircuts, and it's really uh, fucking becoming a problem. I mean, really fucking becoming a problem, because not, I mean, that's where, I mean, I got, the, I mean, there's two portions to the test that we got to take. The whole point of going to barber school is to get ready for the state board. You know, so you gotta have a state board certification to be a barber, or to get a barber's license working in a barber shop. Ew, doobie snack. But, so there's a written part, and there's a practical part, <coughs> meaning the hands-on, <coughs> whatever. <coughs> but, Motherfuck, man. Sorry, I'm keep getting distracted. These fucking people over there are fucking with me. <laughs> but, god damn it, if, dude, I could, I could pass the written test today probably. I know all this shit. I know saprophytes to parasites. I know staphylococci, streptococci, diplococci. I could give you all their names and shapes and fucking what they cause. All of, all this shit, man. I, I mean, I got this shit down. But, the practical part, the actual cutting of hair. I'm getting better, but I don't know if I'm getting better fast enough to fucking pass the state board in this short 10 months, 1,500 hours that this college is, you know, it's only a 1,500 hour course, when you get 10 months or less, you know, 10 months or less to learn this shit, and then once you're out, you're out, out of school, that is. becoming uh, worrisome for me, because I don't have, mostly it's the shaving, uh, straight razor shaving that I'm worried about is going to fuck me up on the test, I've got the hair cut down, I think, I have my model picked, I've already performed a cut on him, the state board cut on him once uh, he came in, that was my first time actually cutting on the dude that I'm going to be cutting on at, at state board, and um, my instructor told me, 
Um, you know, the cut would have passed, but it, it, there's a lot more to it than just the haircut. There's this everything that you have a lot of shit to do an hour and a half for the practical part of this test. Your scalp manipulations, facial manipulations, meaning scalp massage, facial massage, sh uh, straight razor shave, uh, shampooing, uh, um, a bunch of other shit that I'm forgetting, but uh, you got you got to demonstrate hair, everything down to hair rollers and curlers, like, and it's all done with an hour and a half. It has to be. So you see why I'm slightly worried. Because if you're not prepared. <coughs> By the time you get out of school, it's not like you can go back and fucking start start over and shit. You know what I mean? So you can go back and retake the test as many times as you want, but I mean, I'm hoping to pass it on the first try because that shit costs money to take the test. But anyway, my bowl's done. I'm medicated and I need to make my way to Circle K. So love, peace, and hair grease. I'll be seeing y'all on the interwebs later on. So in the meantime, <clears throat> stay medicated. Remember that cigarettes will kill you, vaping will save you. Um, hipsters are lame. And that's about all the words of wisdom I have for right now. In the immortal words of Dr. Dre, I smoke weed every day. Yeah. So, peace.